Here's Johnny! Hi friends, this is Home Theory Addiction here and today we're gonna have a little review and analysis of this uh, receiver Onkyo TX and R545. This receiver is a 100 watts per channel, it's a 7.2. Uh, it supports 4K, HDR, Spotify music, tune-in radio and so on. What I like most about this receiver is that it's wireless. These antennas here is the wireless uh, system where you can play the Spotify music in your smartphone connected to the same e internet of your house or actually you can download the application on your remote and you can control your receiver with your smartphone. Another thing which I believe is very important about this receiver is that supports a standby mode. The standby mode is when you, do, you don't want to bother someone when you're playing loudly with your speakers. What does it do this standby, with this hybrid standby mode? Uh, for example, you're playing with the HDMI, uh, with your PS4 connected to the HDMI 1, and for example, you assign the HDMI in the hybrid standby mode so you can once you turn off your receiver a yellow light will, will turn on and the receiver will project without sound sound with any sound on your speakers the the ps4 on your screen so you will be able to play with the tv speakers now we're gonna take a little video about how hybrid standby works Okay, I hope you understand what was the hybrid standby mode about. Now we're gonna have a little, a little video about the performance of the Spotify in your speakers. Now we're going to have a look at the back of this receiver. As you can see here, it's, it has six HDMI connections and three of them support HDCP 2.2 that are compatible with 4K Blu-ray players or Xbox One S or PS4 Pro that support the HDCP 2.2. Another thing that we have here is that we can plug a center speaker from speakers surround speakers and the backer height. The backer height speakers you can mount them right here on the wall it's front height or you can mount them in your back okay and another thing that you can mount is the Dolby Atmos speakers and you have to connect them right here in the backer height and you have to configure them in your receiver and the Atmos speakers you can mount them on the roof or you can mount them right here in the tower speakers right here in the top of it. So now we're gonna have a performance of a movie, The Donker and the video game Call of Duty World War II. So you can check how it really sounds and the performance of this receiver is wonderful. Now we're gonna take Yeah, 
Uh, he's down to the count. For this leader, one round it down. For this leader, do you mind? For this leader, I have you on my call. I have no eyes on for this leader. Robert? I'm just there for this one. I'll be for a week. It's now or never. Hey, I wish I was coming home to her. Yeah, just wait till we hit Paris. Seems like a long way off. Remember, no digging in at the shore. You gotta advance. You need to stay low and do not bunch up. Stick to your training, you're gonna make it through. I'm proud to lead you fellas in the back. Anytime, anywhere. All right, give him hell, boys. The beaches are supposed to be flat, right? Don't care, brother. No, sir. You should be. Daniel, you got a light? Sure thing. about this receiver is one of the cheapest one in the market I bought it for an accessible price and as you as you saw in the other video the movie and video game performance sound is amazing the picture quality as well is very good but I recommend you to buy a high quality HDMI cable mine is on its way I bought a rocket Fitch HDMI cable and I'm gonna review in another future video okay uh, well as I said before, it's one of the cheapest one that supports Dolby Atmos, HDR, HDCP 2.2, it's wireless, uh, supports uh, Wi-Fi as well. So I highly recommend this. If you don't have a high budget for buying a home theater system, this is the cheapest one. Okay, it's something that you can start with. So I hope this video helps, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, uh, leave opinions thoughts in the comment box and I will answer immediately because I like to keep in contact with my uh, youtuber followers so I'm gonna answer immediately okay so stay tuned guys thanks for watching and this was Home Theory Addiction